Raise your hands if you have a tattoo. Tamara, don't raise your hand. Um, <laughs> getting lots of tattoos can have a surprising health benefit. A new study published in the American Journal of Human Biology last week suggests that people with multiple tattoos have a better immune response to new tattoos than people who are getting tattooed for the first time. Now, what's interesting about this, so, you know, when you're getting a tattoo, your body is actually undergoing a lot of trauma, right? So you have these needles and it's pushing into the uh, middle layers of your skin if you're, you have a good tattoo artist and they're not like jamming it yeah. in there. Um, but it's the middle of your skin, just enough so it'll hold ink. And it's basically causing all these little pinpoint traumas on your skin. And your body in reaction has a very unique uh, inflammatory immune response. And your body goes to the scene of the crime, heals it up, whatever happens. And it turns out that people with multiple tattoos actually feel less pain and heal better and there's less of an immune response than those who are getting their tattoo for the first time. Now what's interesting about this is scientists are extrapolating saying that it may be possible that people with more tattoos have better immune systems overall. That is let to be proven but that's what scientists are saying. What do you think, Tamara? Are you buying it? More tattoos, more healthy? I think, think it's cool. The way they explain it in the story is the fact that it's kind of like exercising. The first time you do it, it hurts a lot, and then you keep it's doing like you're it. you're out of shape exercising. Yeah, and your body just keeps getting used to it, which mm -hmm. I think is a cool way to think about it. But at the same time, it makes me wonder, if I, if I fell a lot in a short period of time and just kept getting sh abrasions, would the same thing happen? I don't know. Are you... Do do you become immune to falling and getting? I hope I you know. get better balance. I guess but... it makes sense. I mean, so I know some people that are like tattoo artists. That's what they do for their job. And, you know, obviously they have tattoos all over their body. And I think after a certain point, if you talk to any of them, they're like, yeah, tattoos like really don't even hurt anymore. Yeah. But how far does it go between a mental thing or an actual physical property? Or yeah. are your mind actually making your body prepared for this reaction because you've gone through it so many times? I think that's like the system that I'm more leaning to thinking that it is because I feel like your psyche handles so many more things than we associated with. But mm -hmm. who knows? I don't know. I that's think it's a cool study. To I look don't know, at. Tamara. You might be onto something there. I mean, because the mental especially like the first time you get a tattoo you don't know what's going yeah, on yeah like, you is have this high, really gonna hurt high and anxiety. honestly they really don't hurt that much no. at least in my experience everyone has different pain tolerance i'm not someone with a lot of pain tolerance i'm like generally like kind of a wuss <laughs> um but i didn't find tattoos to be particularly painful um but do you, you know, get sick often no i mean I, I probably have an above average immune system I'm is not it someone, because of your tattoos? Maybe it is. I mean, I'm not someone who uh, doesn't get sick at all. Yeah. Um, I do get sick, but, I, you know, it's not very frequently. I don't know. There are so many factors that are linked to this that I think it could be really interesting to study. It could be anything from the different chemicals and things that are actually in the ink itself that your body is fighting yeah. off oh. or the puncture oh. itself yep. or the fact that there's just things in the air that are involved in the situation when you're stabbing yourself multiple times anywhere on your body. I think you're right, Tamara. This is, in fact, much more complicated than this news article led on. But, of course, people don't want to hear that. They just want that, no. that sweet headline. Yeah. So let me know what you think in the comments below, folks. Don't forget to subscribe.